Here at the Autumn Moon Festival, treats like dragon beard candy are bringing the community together to celebrate Chinese and Asian culture in San Francisco. From customary dance to traditional music, the annual Autumn Moon Festival brought the Bay together in the spirit of culture and community. Chinese dessert maker Derek Tam says he loves the celebration and the guests are fans of his creations. You can see the people, they love it. An expert at traditional dragon bread candy, Derek is the fifth generation in his family to continue this handcrafted royal dessert. He says the festival is a beautiful reminder of family. Why it called Moon Festival? Because yeah, every time when we celebrate it, it means the family together. And expanding his family now from Hong Kong to the U.S. means so much to him. He loves demonstrating his unique dessert to those unfamiliar with the treat. People, they never saw yeah, how to stretch the molasses because you know the molasses originally is brown color. And educating others about Chinese traditions is also a passion of nearby vendor Anna Wong. The children's book author says the festival is a reminder of her childhood. Growing up, I celebrated the Autumn Moon Festival just by eating moon cakes, and so I never really knew the legends. And that was one of the reasons I wrote and illustrated my book, because there's so much in our culture that I don't know, and I'm learning and I want to share with everyone. She says the rise in hate crimes against Asians inspired her to further share the beauty of her heritage. With all that anti-Asian hate, I really want to celebrate our culture and take pride in Chinese culture, and, and that was the catalyst for creating my books. Derek's passion for his dragon bread candy is also rooted in the joy of sharing his traditions with others. This is a really beautiful uh, handicraft that I want to share to the people, especially to the culture they are not familiar about this world. Culminating with an official mooncake cutting, the festival was a reminder of the vibrant cultural diversity San Francisco continues to boast.